I decided I was going to move to California because I was tired of the cold weather in Chicago. I just moved there and started looking for people to play with and uh, started this band just to have a good time, really. I, I had pretty much given up on trying to get signed at the time and uh, just found some cool dudes to play with and tried experimenting with a bunch of different stuff. And uh, after about a few years, we kind of turned into what we are, Evil Disco. Um, I was playing in this, this thrash metal band in Chicago at the time, and, and we had come out to L.A. to do a record in 93, November of 93. So we made the record, and then we drove back to, to Chicago in a van. And we got back to Chicago, and it was like 10 degrees and an ice storm. And, and I was like, you know what? Fuck this. I'm, I'm fucking out. I'm done with this shit. So I fucking gave notice at work. I went with my credit card, and I bought a pickup truck. And I took everything I could pack into my pickup truck, put the cats in there, and drove across the country. And I knew one person in LA, so they let me stay at their house for like you know a week or whatever, so I could find somewhere else to live. You know, had this, all this massive credit card debt because you know I was broke ass you know musician. And I didn't have any money, so I, I what I did is I got two credit cards. I bought a truck with one, and then I lived on the other one for a while. And I remember. The world before the internet. Like I think the internet has ruined civilization as we know it forever. And I, I think the the repercussions of of this is we're just beginning to see it. I think it's ruining everyone's social skills. No one has a sense of boundaries anymore. They don't know how to talk to people. They say things on the internet with no accountability that they would never say to your face. And I think it's just completely ruined everything. And that's just the, the social part of it. And then I could go into how it's ruined the, the music industry, not just because of downloads, but there's no, there's no mystery in it anymore. Like when I was a kid, you would wait, wait for months and months for, for your ne favorite band's next record come out. And now you can just go on the internet and do a search on something. There's like videos on YouTube. Everyone is overloaded with all this information. And yeah, I think it's, it's not ruined. true. Too. Yeah, it's ruined everything. I fucking hate the internet. Um, don't get in it for the money. Just try to have a good time and do your own thing, create your own sound, create your own look, and have a good time. And who knows what's going to happen with the music industry? You know, because like all the record companies are broke now. And yeah, it, I don't think you know getting signed should be your goal at this point. Um, I would say, you know, try to have a good time and get big in your market, whatever town you're in. Just work that, you know, try to do your own thing, put on a good show, get people to come out, create your own scene, and do everything you can for yourself, you know, don't just rely on some manager to do everything for you.